Hey everyone, my name is Jackie Jess and welcome to a brand new series of mine of the PSA missions. I will be going through all 11 of them. Um, not in this video, I'll be starting a series as I already said. Um, each episode will be being one mission. I will cut out parts that are not important to the actual mission itself. Um, I'm going to try and make it more of like a let's play, not like a walkthrough or anything like that. I want to like bring you along with me along the, the mini journey that it brings us, you know? Um, so yeah, without further ado, let's get straight into it. So I guess I'm just gonna start it. So as as you can see, yeah, I've already done the case for missing puffles before, maybe maybe a couple months ago, but it's still pretty fresh in my mind. I'm gonna go I'm gonna do it today. So it's case of the missing puffles, Antarctic famous reporter for the Cop Penguin Times is very upset because two of her pet puffles are missing. Will you take the challenge of rescuing them? Yes, of course. Let's launch the mission. Um, and yeah, let's get straight into the the mission. Okay, so yeah. Oh, this brings back memories, man. <laughs> All right. Yep, I think I already read this. Yep. Let's let's start the mission now. Okay, here we are in Antarctic's igloo. Let's see what she wants to say. Thank goodness someone is here to help me. I think some of my puffles are in trouble. They're missing. Okay, when did this happen? It happened an hour ago. I was doing some reporting for the Cobbing in Time, so I brought my camera with me to take pictures. What happened next? Two of the puffles must have hidden my camera bag, because when I got home, I saw that they were missing and my camera was gone too. Oh my goodness, this is actually so sad. <laughs> okay, could you describe your puffles for me? Yeah, the green one, okay, one I loves to explore and be goofy, yep. Yeah. And the purple one likes to take pictures. All right, cool. Don't worry, Antarctic, I will find them. Oh, please find my puffles. I need to know that they are safe. Okay, cool. <laughs> so yeah, as you can see, this is the rest of it. I already know what's going to happen next, but yeah. Is, uh, yeah, so it's pretty cool. What the? Okay. <laughs> okay, so I'm pretty sure we just head out here. I don't really remember what the first place to go to. Like, what, what's the best place to go to? Um, I think the ice rink. I think you can pick up something here. Let's look around a bit. I love how these rooms are um are made. It looks so different. All right, so yeah, there's um some pictures, um some photographs that the puffles have taken, and I'm pretty sure that's like a clue. And this is the inventory, and this is the code list to to make it like easier to to decrypt things. Okay, I think the next place to go to is actually the pet shop, where uh yep we've got this. And there is a note behind uh, the the uh, little puffle house. So I already know what this is gonna is gonna say. So so this character right here means G. Oops, um, which is short short for Gary. <laughs> so Gary has now what's a square? Square is E. So maybe eighty. I'm assuming. Um, I'm I'm looking for an I. What's I? Yep, eighty. So I, I can just tell that's an eighty. Uh, G has 80. Now, what's that number? So it's an X with, okay, 81. I'm assuming it's 81 because E is used regularly in many words. So yeah, it's G has 81. Now, I'm pretty sure this means pairs of socks from the last time I can remember it. And then what does this one mean? I actually can't remember. So I'm pretty sure it means, where is it? Where is it? I've... No, I have no idea. It's a circle with the top left um, corner. Does it even have that? Am I missing this? Am I blind? Hello, it's a beautiful day on the ski hill. Can I get you something? Uh, yes, please. Check out the catalog for everything you need to get around the clubbing with star. Um, but I, I want some special items. Well, there are some other special items. You can take a look at them if you answer this question. And the question is, how many pairs of socks do I own? I already know, it's 81, and we just enter that in, and then, uh, yeah. Oh, so you're a secret agent. Pleased to meet you. My name is G, and I invent all the spy gadgets. Yep, yeah, G's short for Gary. May I see some of these spy gadgets? Sure, for me. Nice little animation there. Here's some of my spy equipment I've invented that might come in handy. Take what you need. Thank you very much. I will take this grappling hook and this life preserver shooter. So it can launch life preservers over long distances. That's pretty cool. Okay, so um, I'm pretty sure now we, we've covered the ice rink, pet shop, sports shop. Let's head over to the ski mountain. 
Okay, so we, we find this this brown penguin here, okay, with a telescope. So I just saw some penguins in trouble on the iceberg. They look stranded. Okay, okay, let's uh, let's head over to the iceberg then. Okay, well, we have got the gadget for this right now. Okay, let's uh, let's put it down. I'm pretty sure they they want some help. So let's so let's actually shoot this. <laughs> Look at that. Okay, so you have to you have to aim with the wind. Okay, it's kind of odd to use. Let's see if I can get every single one. All right, this this blue guy is is, is not wanting to come off the iceberg. I swear, I've shot like ten. 10 um, life preservers at you. Come on, dude. Oh my gosh, I'm so bad at this. <laughs> no. Uh, oh, wow. I am... Come on. There we go. Finally. It's like that guy wanted to stay in the other iceberg. <laughs> I saw two puffles. One had a propeller cap on and the other was carrying a camera. They flew away, but I don't know where. If I was higher up, maybe I could have seen where they went. Now that leads us on to the tallest mountain. Makes sense. So, um, again, I've kind of gone ahead throughout the... Uh, Throughout the mission. Whoops. Anyways, I've gone throughout the mission. I've already gathered all the gadgets necessary for this. So yeah, this is the tallest mountain on Club Penguin. So let's use this grappling hook and go all the way up. Hmm, nothing much to do up here. Okay, so I must be missing something in the mission. Now I think I know what it is. I'm gonna go over to the ski mountain again. Yes, that's right. So I've got to got to help this guy. I was using my homemade telescope to look around the club penguin and it fell apart. So we need to help this guy. Um, we need to we need to fix it basically for him. So I almost forgot, but we have this tools, um, little gadget thing, and we can use this little um screwdriver. Wait, what do you call these? A wrench? Oh, I have no idea. Um, yeah, that's that's how you fix the telescope, by the way, guys. <laughs> Thank you so much. I'll just click on the telescope and I'll let you go. I'll let you look through it. So yeah, I couldn't go to the tallest mountain, but I think now that I look at it, I'll be able to see, yep, there's the puffles, and they match the description that Antarctic, um, the Antarctic showed us with the green puffle. Um, okay, so now let's head back to the um, tallest mountain and try and see if we can actually find the green puffle this time. Hey, you must be one of Antarctic's missing puffles, it, it seems. It's, uh, yeah, then, and there's the other one, taking pictures, just like she said she would. Come on, Puffles, let's go back to the Antarctic igloo. Alright, you found my Puffles, I'm so glad they're safe. Happy to help Antarctic, I found them at the top of the tallest mountain, which is pretty amazing. Why were they up there? I guess, uh, they probably wanted to take a picture, <laughs> and, uh, maybe to help the, with the newspaper, yep. Oh, that makes sense, ever since I got it, it has loved to take pictures with my camera. I'd love to stay and talk some more, but I have to go back to headquarters now. Thank you for doing such a good job, not only in bringing my puffles back to me, but helping others around you. Nice. If I need any more help in the future, you'll be the one I call. Nice. Thank you very much. See you again sometime. Goodbye. All right. That was the end of the mission. I'm not sure how long that lasted, but I think we'll end it off there and continue the next mission in the next episode of this new series. So, yeah, I think I've already got the medal for this. Yeah, I'll show it to you when I um, get out of this and head back to HQ. Um, I can't really remember what it looks like. Let's, uh, let's check the awards. Alright, I think it's this one. Correct me if I'm wrong. Golden Puffles Medal, awarded for terrific performance in locating and returning Antarctic's two mission puffles. Nice, okay, so that's that's the award. Um, every mission you complete, you earn one of these awards, and uh, yeah, hopefully I'll be able to earn more of these medals throughout the series. Um, if you enjoyed this episode and you want to see more from me, make sure to like this video to support me, and subscribe if you are new. But anyways guys, that is it for me today, so I'll see you all in the next video.